Well, today we're going to see the Taipei Botanical Garden. This is one of my sections. I love palms. I've been learning a lot about palm trees lately. I see, they have any names on any of these palms. Is that a palm there? I like that palm with the uh, crown shaft on it. Palms with crown shafts are my favorite. Ravenella radagascarensis sonia. Well, I think this is from Madagascar. Looks like a big banana tree. Nice pond here. Soon as a fish in it somewhere. Water's a little dirty. Maybe even a turtle or two. Well, this is the uh, fern garden here. I see some little fishes down there. Not little big ones. Not very big ones. I don't see any platyceriums. Lots of. Uh, Oh, bird's nest firms. Got a low battery, so I don't know how long I'm going to last here.
There's a, a tree fern here. Looks like bamboo. The parts we usually see are the, of a plant's body, especially the roots, stems, and leaves, are what is known as the sporophyte of the fern. Sporophytes produce spores, and spores grow into gamophytes from which the Antheridia and Archegonia grow and develop. The Antheria release sperms, which moves into the Archegonium and fertilize the egg. The zygote begins to divide and grow into an embryo, which grows, grows and differentiates into adult sporophyte. There's a big difference between the life cycles of ferns and seed plants. Most of the time, a seed plant stays as a sporophyte and the gamophyte life form is only parasitic on the sporophyte. The seed plant's zygote develops into an embryo which is contained within the seed. The seed then sprouts and grows into a sporophyte plant or plant, sporophyte which is the plant body. On the other hand both the sporophyte and the gamophyte of ferns live independently of each other. It looks like a male and a female. Well we finally find, found our first platycerium this whole little garden. I don't know if that's a Wolinkiite, bifurcatum, or what we got here. It's in the bifurcatum family. Well that's about all I've got for the Taipei Botanical Garden. There's a quite a bit more to see with uh, had a big succulent section and some other in uh, sections with uh, or plants related with insects how they kind of work together and yeah, but he was so hot and, and I was just I, I was in pain uh, it, it was just so hot and sweaty down there it was about 90 degrees it was about 75 percent humidity so it wasn't very comfortable and then I was started having running out of batteries I didn't have my batteries charged up properly I only had my GoPro camera charged up and even then the gimbal on it was not charged so um, Apologize for the poor photography, but uh, I'll be better prepared. Uh, tomorrow morning, very early, I take off for Thailand, and we'll start seeing some gardens over in the Thailand. But this is about the end of our uh, uh, Taiwan deal. We're really exhausted. So uh, if you like this video, hit the like button down below, the thumbs up button, I think it is. If you want to see some more videos, hit the subscribe button, and then click on the little bell there, and it'll tell you They'll give you notification when new videos come out. Thanks for now, and we'll talk to you later.